I'm back at Leanne with our ATCs um, and this is the last two. I, I was away on Sunday so I didn't put an ACT out but I've got the next two which was, let me see, what day are we up to? The 19th today but I've done two more anyway. Um, I did this one. It's a beautiful green. It's hard to see online but it does have a beautiful green colour to it. And this one is a proper ACT card. It's a canvas, canvasy one and it says let your dreams take flight. There we go. So there are two that I've done. Now what are we up to? It's day 19. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. That's up to date till today, which is Monday. But I'm going to show you one online because I didn't show you any online yet for a while. So I thought I would. So I've got my ACT here. I've actually uh, had two pieces of cardstock and I've glued them together to get a little bit of weight to this one. And all I'm going to do is glue it down on this beautiful paper. And it's going to be hard to see. See the colours? Beautiful colours. And uh, it's more vivid uh, when you see it live to your face, but not on camera. Um, the colours seem a bit dull, but they're not. They're very, very bright. So we are going to cover our card in. And I think I will glue the card. Yes. So I want to put a lot of glue on because I want this paper to stay down. And I haven't got much of that left. Radio, let's see if we can get it down evenly. Out there on the wrong side. Silly me. <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. Now it's on the right side. See, I fixed it. Right. Now there's a, a little bit more paper on each side than I like. I'd like it about this thin. Well, I'd actually like it that thick, but I didn't have much of this left. So I will cut a little bit away to make it a little bit more neater. Just like that. Same as that side. Well, my desk is getting very restricted here. Right now, cut off the corners. About like that. And we are going to fold them over. So start folding them over. They've got no glue on them at the moment, but that's okay. Now you can see the advantage of having this a lot longer. So the card's more um, stable. Well, it's more thicker um, and more balanced. So you get more weightier cards. So we want it like that. Okay, so we're going to glue it down again, the sides. Now I like this method because all you have to do is cover the ATC in with some beautiful gel paint or some painted um, paper or some um, just some cardstock, some pretty paper papers that you might have, some vintage pieces, whatever you've got available to you. You can use this and cut it down exactly the same way as I'm doing right now. And it's very easy to cover the ACT that way. Go and see our cards covered. 
I'm just going to move that off this mat. It's getting a bit sticky, so I'll let it dry. Now I am going to put that down. So voila, there it is. There's LATC. Can you see? It's hard to get the focus there, isn't it? Right. Okay, that's not too bad. Now, the last um, video I did was I was doing some wooden chip little little things. There were some butterflies and that. Um, there was a few other things. I didn't show you how I finished off the thought bubbles or the speech bubbles, whatever you want to call them. There they are there, and there's the camera. I did the camera. And there they are. There's all the little wood chips that I did. I just covered them in, collaged them with some paper. And I've got these I'm going to work with on this card. Right, I think our card's pretty much done, except for a pastel. And I'm going to do the edges in a green pastel, give it a little bit more colour and a little bit more of an edge. All I'm going to do is do a line through it, the edge line. And I'm going to just smooth that out and let it blend in to the yellow and the other greens. Nelly lost it. And that's all I'm going to do. And it's very simple to do. It gives it a little bit more of a definition and gives it a pretty colour green to match the other greens. Just like that. I wonder if you can see it. You can? Yeah. I think it just blends in very well with it. Yeah, I think it does. Looks good. Um, a bit hard for you to see from there, isn't it? As I said, you can't see the vividness of that. Okay, let's see our butterflies. I was thinking about putting one there. Maybe another one here. Yes, yeah, that's not too bad. And I've got my banner still. I want to put my banner on. Let me just see if I can fit it on amongst the butterflies. Put my butterfly there. I should be able to do that. What does that look like? That's a lot on one little card, isn't it? But I like it. So I'm going to do it. Now i just got a word here called free. I just had it sitting around. I haven't made it up specially. Um, but I'll throw it down there just to use it. And that is not too bad. I think that that may work. So I think I'll leave it in place like that. Like that. Just pull that string along a little bit more to see if I can maneuver them a lot better to the edge lines. See if I can move that a little bit more like that. That doesn't look too bad. Okay, now I have got my glue gun on. You will need a glue gun for this um, because they're wood chips and that has got no glue in it. How did that happen? Must have burnt away. I was a silly girl because I left this on all day and I didn't even realise that I had left it on. Isn't that terrible? <laughs> and I went away. <laughs> anyway, let's go.
let's try and get this down quickly. Nope, it goes this way. Oh dear. We're gonna have to squash that down because it dries so quickly. Um, you need to be in position for it. So I'm going to have to be careful here when I make sure I get it flat. Like that. Oh, nearly had my finger stuck. Right, I might put that word down now. And then we've got our banner. Like that. I'm going to leave it in situ the way it is and I'm going to glue it down like that. that one put that down to like that all right now let's have a look at the string um, I think we can cut that off I don't think we need it anymore on there. Um, but what I will do is I will glue it because I um, don't want it coming loose. So I'll just give it a tiny bit there to hold it in. There, like that. Okay, and I think we can then cut it. There we go. And this one here, I'll do the same. I'll just give it a bit of glue just there where the string is. You can lay down flat. And then I can cut with the rest off. Like that. Got a few strands on it, but that's what it looks like. Okay, now let's just do a little bit more of that green. So I just want to bring it out more. It's doing a really good job. The pastel, it's giving it some defining border and a bit of shading which is really nice right I think I like that I'll just put away this pastel before I drop it Right, now just get a pen, um, probably a gel pen, let me see, where's my gel pen, no, that's a sharpie, there it is, 
Right. Okay, I'll just define the border on the uh, word three. And I'll give it a little bit of an edging with the gel pen. Just so it pops a bit more. And I think that's done. There we go. Here it is. So we used our wood chips, our two butterflies, a banner, the word free on it. That is another ACT. Um, so that was one way of um, showing you how to use your wood chips. Um, and um, that will be uh, another one that I've done. So I'm really right up to date now. So there's three more. So I've got that one called Dream. All I did was use the same um, as I did with that. I used the paper. I glued that down and uh, put a word on it, put a stamp on it, put little few embellishments, some washi tape up there as you can see and that's hard to see too. The colours are very vivid from my end um, but it just doesn't show up that way in your end. So they're very bright and striking but they look dull to you. And there's this one, now this one's a beautiful ACT. Not thick as me pearl. Pop back on pearl. And this one says May I'll let your dreams take flight. Now this one I put a lot of pastels in the background. Actually, no, that's paint. Nope, acrylics. I'm sorry, I forgot. Then I tissue papered this beautiful, sorry, this is tissue paper and I put that on there with some um, matte medium and then um, put some flowers on it that and I also did a script uh, stamping on it as well. That dark purple and that, that is a tissue. It comes from a, a serviette or napkin, whatever you want to call them. And I used that, collaged it on the background of the script and that. And the script came through, sh shine through. And then we did this one today. Here it is, the back. And there's the front. Now you could have used, uh, this is green. It looks a bit bluish, doesn't it? But um, it's not. It's green and yellow. And you have the yellow around the border, uh, the green around the border. Pastel. There's our butterflies. You can see them. And our banner. And there's another one. So I'm up to date till tomorrow so that's great um, so um, I'll do another one tomorrow for the next day and um, I hope you enjoyed that one I just did so please everyone take care on the roads and take care in your lives see you next time bye for now